Hello, hi, and welcome to Zai Omogashi. My name is Virtus. Continuing Thirsty Suitor. Continue. Yes, please. Her thighs are too powerful. Jada came face to face with Tyler, her first love, whose heart she broke. Awkward. Oh, and there was a new, now a cult of skate punks at the Bear Foot Park. And what does the creepy bear have to have a throne? Look at guys, look at my, my beautiful LGBT plus, um, um, cardigan? No. Sweater. Jacket, whatever. Oh yeah, we give that. This you loser. actually made me cut this sambal? Wow, thank you! We don't like you. I just want to see what happens. It's not a declaration of eternal devotion or anything. Oh, no, 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 no. Of course not. Maybe just fleeting devotion? No. Don't push your luck. No, ma'am. Wouldn't dream of pushing your buttons. I hate you, Sergio. Shut up. So, how's it been being back home? My dad looks older. Mom being fake nice. My mom didn't shout at me. She's actually being really polite. polite. Oh god, that's horrible. Right? Like some wasp mom off the TV. Please and thank you and would you like a snack? Oof. He must be waiting for the axe to fall. Yeah, I wish she'd just get it over with. <laughs> no way. Our mom is gonna let you marinate. Hope you like stew. Thanks again for the sambal, Jala. And hey! You've got my number. Text me if you want to talk. No, I'm not texting you, man. Indeed. Good job, kid. You cannot text Sergio from the relationship menu. Thank you, Uncle Hinty. We're not besties. I mean, we're not. We're not dating. We're just besties. Tech suitors unlocks new quest in butcher relationship. We're not dating. I hate you. Don't get him. Don't get it twisted. Okay, I don't like you. I hate you. What's up, doggy? Who is it? Oh, Tyler. What up, girl? What up, bae? What up, G? Hey, are you busy? No, why? Go to skate park. The bear wants to see you. Okay, we go see the bear. Go to skate park. <laughs> Okay, for, for okay, guys. Actually, I do not text like that, but I guess people in this gener this generation do. Y'all lazy as hell. Like, guys, I took computer class when I was in high school, and like, I talk, I text hella fast. So for me, I'm just like, who the heck needs to type like that? Because I type so fast, I don't need text like that. But if you guys do. That's too bad. That's too bad to say you lazy. If you text me like that, I will block you. Okay, no one texts me like that. If you text me like that, I don't think you care about me. So don't text me like that. Okay, comprende? Comprendo? Friendos? Ooh, I smacked him. Ooh. Move it, boy. Don't you see, I got moves to pay the bills, um, Don't you see? Let's go. I hate you, Sergio. Don't ask me nothing. Okay, we ain't besties. I don't love you. I don't like you. Okay, my heart is all in for Tyler. Yeah, look at that. Rubber ducky, you're the one. I feel like I've seen that off of Elmo. Oh yeah, yeah, I forgot we can run. But wait, am I pushing it? Oh, combos! I stole your boy! I forgot his name, but I stole him! Let's go, bear loser! Come on, G! What you want to do? Where I come for you? Jala, Jala, Jala. I knew you couldn't resist the call of the park. I hate you, shut up. What is with all these damn people doing on this whole... Oops. 
What is what all you people think I'm in love with you? I'm not in love with you. Before you embark on your next battle, you need to sharpen your skills. Perhaps a few of my skate challenges will rub off some of that rust. Huh? Indeed. Skate challenges are optional, my dear. I don't care. I hate them. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Face another of my cup leaders. Oh. Okay. Who? Oh, Cece. How would one describe her? Uh -oh. Perhaps a pufferfish made of cotton candy. Pufferfish. Statue encasing an exposed nerve, a block of ice surrounding a flaming, bleeding heart. Huh? What? <laughs> Cece's passions were all consuming before I gave her direction. Her dreams vibrated from under her skin before she gave them up for me, of course. You're such a loser. Don't be fooled by her apathetic demeanor. She believes. <laughs> How Cardi can it be? You really think a bunch of kids in a skate-themed cult can intimidate me? They're dedicated to something bigger than them. That makes them more powerful than you can ever imagine. Isn't there part of you that yearns for that kind of faith? A cause. Hell no. I don't need to be no bear cult, boo. I got the VV cult, aka my fandom. Enough chit chat. Here in Barefoot, we let our skills do the talking. Okay, let me go fight them then. I'll be talking. awaiting the outcome with great curiosity. Why are you wearing a cape? Who do you think you are? You ain't cool. This damn bear. Who the heck do you think he is? Damn boy, come on, boy wonder. Oh hell no, I'm not fighting. I'm not skating. I mean, I like the skating guys, but some of the challenges are kind of annoying. And I just want to get to the story, you know. I might do some. No. What up, girl? Oh, you got green hair. CC, one of Soundy's club bit leaders. It tossed. It's a toss-up which is deadly. Her skate skills are stone chasm. Oh, yeah. We have to fight or whatever. She's so apathetic. Let's get this over with. I <clears throat> will defeat you. Etc, etc. Who are you? So, my name is Jala. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. This is the part where you say your name too. It's Cece. Can we fight now? Do you even know why we're fighting? Trust me, I know all about your whole prodigal son returns thing, Jella. But apparently, your past includes you breaking my best friend's brother's heart. Now, she hates you. Wait, what? But apparently your past includes you breaking my best friend's brother's heart. Wait, is Tyler your brother? Best friend's brother's heart. Because um, I read the thing and it said that Tyler actually transitioned. So Tyler was originally a man, but transitioned to a girl. So I'm guessing, guessing Tyler goes with she, uh, she or her pronouns now. And I might have some bad news to tell her. What you got? So I definitely need to destroy you. It's just not personal. What do you mean? It is personal. What do you want? This isn't even about me. Not wanting to upset your friend sounds like a you problem. Yeah, uh huh? Got you, girl. Have you even tried talking to her? Just be straightforward. I always am. I know, and look what happened to you, Jala. Since when? <laughs> By straightforward, you mean allowing your horniness to drive you straightforward and towards doom? Sure, maybe. Oh. You know what? I actually am pissed off now i like your hair girl prepare to die but like with more intentionality now oh, okay 
Let's flirt with her. <laughs> That'd be funny. Come on, girl. I'm sexy. You know me. Look at me, girl. Can't resist. Yes. I know lovesick when I see it. I'll accept your forfeit for pointers. Fail proof pointers. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. She's not into it. Stop. Try another one. Okay, how about how about how about how about rage? Let's make a man. Oh shoot. Weak. That's all. I'm gonna make you eat those words. You. I mean, oh, whatever. It's okay. You have feelings. Embrace them. Come on, man. You have feelings. Embrace those feelings. Boing, bugger. Sandy's loyal to this town because he loves it. Aisha's loyal to the people she loves, and I'm one of them. Who's Aisha? If I just left, I'd be as gross and toxic as you were. I could never do that. You're too guilty. You're really beating yourself up too much, aren't you? If there's a voice inside of you telling you to leave Timber Hills, you should listen. It might be right. I kind of learned a lot when I left. First time taking care of yourself and a partner. God knows Jennifer wasn't going to help. Who's Jennifer? I forgot really. Stop trying to advise me. I'm not you. I'm not making your mistakes. Why does everyone know my mistakes? Why does everyone know my... Oops, sorry guys. Actually, I'm more convinced than ever in the cause. Now, I'm gonna beat you for Soundy and Aisha. I uh, neighbors are such contrarians. Come on, girl. This is, this is really worth it. I just gotta whoop her out of shape. Bye. Whatever. Okay, let's try a new one. How about how about how about how about a shocking taunt? Come Wait, on, girl. don't tell me. Have you even had your first kiss yet? Ooh. None of your beeswax, creep. Face it, has been. You're in decline. Your prime was a century ago. You've already peaked and faded away. How dare you? What? Why am I crying? Oh my god. Smile, bitch. <laughs> yeah, bring your mom into this. Jala, are you playing with those roller hooligans again? Yes. That's right. Bye. The enemy of my friend is my enemy. I'm pretty sure that's not how the saying goes. I look cute. And kawaii. Whatever. Mantras are for nerds. Mantra? I'm gonna tear you to shreds, Jala. Do I'm it. gonna break your board over my knee and set your stupid Walkman with all of its bad music on fire. Eat me, dork. She really doesn't mince her words, does she? <laughs> Don't cry, Shash. <laughs> oh my god. Knock it off. Don't cry about this. <clears throat> She's almost dead, girl. She's not dead, but like, she was almost knocked out. Yeah, shake it off. Ah, uh, loser. Stop with your nonsense. Come on. Impress her. Come on, girl. I know it's all no hope, no future right now, but that isn't me. I've got too much fight for that. She just isn't into it. 
I turn down five suitors a day because it interfere with my friendship time with Aisha. Who is Aisha? That's dedication. And that's why your flaky ass is gonna fail. Dedication is one word for it. A familiar one. Don't be impressed. Oh my god, what are you doing? your friend like a desperate puppy you might actually have a chance throwing stones glass houses jala although not sure if that advice applies more to you or tyler though <laughs> you cry too stop it oh no pass 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 take it <gasps> Remember, oh, if I'm missing a cool fight for this one, you're totally dead. Then I'm dead, girl. <gasps> Not girl. Ugh, I lost. This sucks. My heart wasn't in it. It's not in any of this, really. Who's Aisha? <laughs> Make your own decision. Who cares about Aisha? You need to do what's right for you. The people who love you will understand if they really care. Maybe you're right. I've been trapped in how I've been thinking about all this. It's my life. And no one else has the right to tell me how to live it. Yes, girl. Preach. Not even Aisha. <laughs> or Soundy. Who's Aisha though? You did good. Let's go. No. No, <laughs> you don't have time. Keep calling me. Meet me at that rock. Now? No, in another three years. Ouch, on my way. What else? <laughs> you mean, you can't ask for that, you know? She would have texted you if she needs you right now. You playing too much. No. Fool. You know what? The skateboard is kind of cool, actually. I'm actually getting the hang of it. Sure, I'm gay. Nice work. You got CC to question Soundy and think for herself. Ah, uh, is it too early? <laughs> is it too early to ask about us? <laughs> we should talk about our name. That's the one we're at. <sighs> but we gotta fix our stuff before we talk to our name. I seem to be having confrontations with my exes all over the place these days. Only a matter of time before we have it out, huh? Do not lump me in with that cavalcade of misfits, losers, and charity cases that you call exes. Ooh. I think you pissed her off. Okay, but it's the wrong time, sorry. Just you breathing pisses me off. If I hadn't given up on skating, I wouldn't even need you to get in the park. You're the one who taught me how to skate in the first place. I wanted an excuse to spend time with you alone. Oh, it is so cute. I liked to skate, but you loved it. You always looked so free out here, unencumbered. I never heard that word, but that's very nice. Ugh, whatever. We're not here to talk about the past. Next time, you'll be battling Aisha. It's not going to be easy. She hates you personally, not just on principle. Why she hate me? Don't mess it up. But why she hate me? I'm pretty sure she knows nothing about my sister anyway. Uh oh, I didn't think you would actually pick up after what you done. Meet me at the bar. Well, let's have a chat. Oops. I got eggs from the past. Well, where's she at? Oh, the bars are here. 
Let's go meet her. Let's go meet our ex. I think she's her ex. Her second ex. Let's see her history. I think she's a lesbian one. Oh, boys got some. Oh, look at me go. Come on, boy. Come on, boy wonder. Yeah, move, fool. Nobody can take over the town but me. Move, girl. Everybody need to move. Oh, psh, I need to move too. <laughs> oh, it's right there. Don't run into that prison to lie. Oops. Oh, shoot. Is that her? Yikes. We doom. We doom. We doom. Nice. Okay, anyway, is it you? I don't want to talk to you. I know we will fight. Okay, whatever, let's go. Hey, girl, who are you? Indeed. Hmm, that seems up. That one seems up to something. If you're not ready for trouble, you can prepare and come back later. I'm ready, let's go. I'm ready to go. Indeed. That's my girl, always rushing ahead long into completely unpredictable situations. Thank you, Uncle Henty. We met at the skate park, right? Yeah, you're that annoying reporter's champion. My ex-girlfriend. Shouldn't you be off doing your taxes or something? Playing bingo? <laughs> I don't, I'm not that old. I'm pretty sure we were in high school at the same time. It's called senior year for a reason. Whatever. Did you come in here for a drink? Or do you have no better place to be? I'm meeting someone, just staying out of trouble. Yep. Hmm. That's a bummer for you. Why? Because someone's just come in for you, and she looks like trouble. Ooh, that's not me, though. I'm not trouble. She's trouble. Whoa. Hey, Jala. What's it been? Three years? It feels like centuries. You should date her. <laughs> but she looks kind of crazy. Not gonna lie. Maybe this won't be as bad as we thought. She sounds friendly. Oh, really? Oh, okay. That's good to hear. I heard you got your heart broken. We did. Ah. Uh. Oh. How does it feel to crawl back home to lick your wounds? <gasps> what did you say? Pretend I dumped her. Pretend it was mutual. Actually, I dumped her. Thanks for your sympathy. I'm glad my misery is such a source of joy to so many people. Between you, Sergio, and my mom, it almost makes up for it. <laughs> You're funny. Take it as a compliment that I'm assuming you have a heart. Ay, ay, ay. You always loved holding on to grudges. Not all of us are so easily distracted by the next shiny object. Hey. Am I making you nervous, Jala? Good. Get used to it. She's not friendly. I'm not your pawn anymore. Oh, what are we doing now, girl? What the heck? She put a queen crown? Whoa, we're in her headspace. Daya, the kind of girl your mother warned you about. She looks, she's looking for revenge, or maybe a date. Probably both. <laughs> you think you're a queen, B? I am a queen. Oh, she did. She, she did. She did. She did think she was a queen. And you will bow down. Well, what gives you that right? Yes, my queen. That's the SCS one. I get it. You're in charge. I'm not here to cause any trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we tell that lady we're not gonna cause trouble. Good. Remember your place while you're in the presence of the Maharani. Dia used to be the middle school mean girl. On the outside, her life was perfect. But really, she was deep in the closet. Oh, girl. You, oh, okay, okay, I got you. What began as Jala confronting Dia about bullying Tyler turned into a torrid secret romance. What? Oh my god, you freaking joking me. You were into her. Wait, she was bullying Tyler. But then you got interested in Daya? Oh, girl, your, your life is messy. Ooh. But it's some good tea, though. Some good tea. 
messy, messy, messy. Those hormones really had a grip on Jala in middle school. Oh no! Don't tell me. Oh no! Don't tell me. You went after her because of your down there. Oh my God! You're downstairs. You're bad. You bad. What are you doing? You bad, Jala. Naughty, naughty. Rude. <laughs> they even started a band together to have an excuse to meet up. Oh, that's bad. But let's just say things ended uh, messy. For the band and for them, Dia's never forgiven her. That's what happened? Sheesh. That's bad. You've been brought before the throne to stand trial for your crimes. What? Why? What did we do? Don't I get a lawyer? This doesn't make. This doesn't seem fair. Crime's a bit much. She's still wounded. You can't hear a lesbian, you know. I demand proper representation. This is a violation of my rights. <laughs> Why don't we just skip to the execution? What? Do you want to execute me already? Yeah. We all know she's guilty. You're making me sound like a tyrant. Please continue. Jala Jayaratna, you stand accused of being a traitor, a liar, a betrayer, and worst of all, a shitty friend. I'm a bad friend? Oh, girl. Let the trial begin. I'm a bad friend. Come on now. Oh, I like her picture up there. Looks nice. Okay, okay, let's, let, let's throw her. Come on, girl. You know you want me. Come on! Can I just say I'm finding your pettiness confusingly hot right now? Is she still into us? Nope, she hates you. Stop! I want to show you how I saw us. <coughs> the world trembled beneath our feet. Our shadows eclipsed stars. Guitars in our hands, we'd lay waste to galaxies you by my side as my general my warlord my celestial commander wow and you would kneel only to me yandere much she's kind of like yandere <clears throat> sure a different one how about how about shocking Girl. You think just because my parents accept my sexuality, they understand me? Have you ever met an Asian parent? Is she not Asian? Girl. The way you touched me back then. You can't fake that. You felt it. Girl, don't talk about that. Don't talk about that, man. When I kissed you, it felt like waking up. Up, like being set on fire, like being on stage, bathed in applause. You didn't even realize you held my heart in your hands, did you? You were so careless. Jolly, you kind of deserved that, good deal. Um, look at me, I'm so cool. Look at me, girl. I'm starting to think all this talk of kneeling and begging is just projection. Maybe you're the one who wants to give in to me. She's oppressed? We were right. <laughs> Got you, girl. Oh. Oh. Uh. Yeah. I got you. We started a band together, Jala. That's eternal. That's sacred. Is she not Asian? She has something like she has an Indian accent too, though. We practiced for weeks for Battle of the Bands. We were ready to go on that stage and dominate. Why didn't you marry her? But you showed up that night with a look in your eye. I thought it was nerves. Anticipation. But up on that stage, you sabotaged us. You played so badly, the crowd threw things at us. We were humiliated. 
Why did you why did you do this to her? She got her lesbian moment and you just ruined it because of your hormones? Jala, come on, you don't mess with the the gays. Okay, you kinda deserved it a little bit, Jala. It's all your fault, girl. Conquerors, gods. She could have been your woman. What you doing? You could have been invincible. But you threw it all away. You threw me away. Gosh, Jala. You betrayed the Maharani. I never understood why. I told Tyler about the band. Tyler kissed me. <laughs> this is all messed up. You were bullying Tyler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait. Let me get straight. So, <clears throat> so for everyone who's watching right now, Tyler was born a man, but Tyler is secretly transgender. Then in high school, Tyler got gender switch surgery. He was going through, um, he was going through that process, and then now he's like who he is today, and he goes with she her. But, and then Daya was a mean girl in middle school, so she didn't have feelings for Tyler until high school. But middle school, Daya was was her girl. Daya was a secret, was in the closet, and she was a secret lesbian. And Tyler, I mean not Tyler, Jala, our main character, I guess her and Daya had a thing, they started a band, you know, and it was Daya's first everything, her first lesbian romance. But she, w I guess she was, I guess Jala was not as into her, and that's why she's mad at her. Oh, come on. Don't pretend you don't know. I asked you to leave Tyler alone. But you didn't just keep messing with her, you escalated. Yeah, duh, I was jealous. Can you blame me, given how things turned out? You know what, that makes sense. That makes sense she was jealous. Tyler was your best friend. It, it makes sense, it makes sense. But after what you did to her, you and me, we were done. So, you replaced me? Ooh. <laughs> that, that's not good. The next thing I know, you show up to school on Monday morning on Tyler's arm. You announced you were together to the whole school. Ooh, that's bad. And what could I say then? No one knew about us. I just had to watch your romance play out. That must have sucked. That was your choice. Okay, okay, okay. Daya was bullying Tyler because she was jealous because she liked Jala. And then Jala decided she didn't want Dala no more and then she with Tyler. Girl, your your life messy. Your life messy. That must have sucked. Yes. Yes, it did. I can't imagine what that must have been like. No, you can't. I had to watch you get everything I wanted, but could never have after you stabbed me in the heart. Ooh, kind of grew with her. You kind of messes you one up. What, Tyler? Me? You left me in the dark. Did you even officially break up with her? <laughs> she was in the closet with you. That's awkward. You were so in love with her the entire time you were with me. Oh, two timey hussy, Jala! What the hell, two timey hussy? That is awkward. Super, super awkward, Jala. Yeah, you should go to. You should get executed. You need to stand trial. You don't get no lawyer. Just straight up execution. Just admit it. I was nothing but a rehearsal for the main event. Don't say that. Oh, too bad. My parents kicked me out of the house when I came out. <gasps> oh my god, it's terrible. You run off with the mayor's daughter. And your parents, they just welcome you back home. Oh, that is bad. Your every smile is a plate of our heart, my queen. You know what? We deserve, we deserve to get slapped. Ooh. Oh, you should say sorry. You fucked up, girl. You messed up. Stop. She's no longer impressed. I want you to kneel. Cry. 
fall. Beg for me. How <laughs> we flirt with her is funny. I know with Sergio we're so mean, but I feel like if Tyler wasn't in the picture, she could have gone with Dala. Because I mean, Dala was her first girl on girl romance, right? So it, it, she has something. Uh, that's. Um. What are you gonna say, Jala? That's not a flirt. You suck. <laughs> that was not a flirt. What was that? Uh oh. I see your guitar playing hasn't improved much. Oh, Jala hurts. Haha, <laughs> drag it to the scaffold. <laughs> Don't cry, we're just lying to you. Wait, I kinda ship them. I, I kinda do. I kinda feel, I feel bad. Cause after hearing her story, I feel like we're kinda in the wrong actually. <laughs> we're kinda in the wrong. What you did to me back in middle school sucked. But you know what's worse? What? What is worse? Your parents accepted your sexuality. They love you. You are so goddamn lucky to have grown up with Auntie C in your corner. Oh, Auntie Sh Chantra? But you left town with Jennifer and didn't come back for three years? Talk about ungrateful. Wait, who is Jennifer? Is Jennifer a last ex? Ooh, we'll get so many damn exes. Okay, okay. I find correct. She's been with three girls and three guys. So she's by Jala, our main character. I think. Because Sergio, the first guy we met, he... He was our third grade boyfriend. So he doesn't really count. I mean, he ain't special. We were only dating him for a week. He don't count. I regret it. I need to leave. Who are you to judge? I need to leave. I couldn't come back. I had to set it all on fire. I couldn't leave myself a path of retreat, you know? You are still so self-absorbed. Do you even know what happened to me after high school? I came out to my parents. They kicked me out. They pretend like they don't even know me when we pass on the street. That is heartless. That's very wrong. You guys should... All parents who do that, you're heartless. You don't love your kid. What do you even say to that? I don't know, narrator. Ugh, stop. I don't want your sympathy. I'm fine. I am thriving. Being me came at a cost and I've paid it. But you, you've always had it so easy. It is time you learned how to suffer. Indeed. Hey, kiddo, pay attention to their weakness. They're gone. She might be focusing on her energy. Something fishy is going on. Something big. Oh, we got some new ones. I'll be using them. Oh wow, she got nothing. I can't use any of these. Bring her mom. She keeps talking about her. Mom. Mom. Oh ma. Uh, uh, uh. Hi, mama. Is that? Yes, it's Jala's mom. She got the shoe. <laughs> you got the zoo. You get the shoe. What the heck? <clears throat> I mean, no, but are you really gonna be this petty about things that happened in middle school? Hey, Jala, I would be petty too. Yes. Oh, at least she's honest. <laughs> you should say sorry. You should be begging for forgiveness. What you did was pretty wrong. Whoa, Come what is she doing? Jala. Aren't you a little curious? I could show you so many things about yourself. If you let me. What What can you show me? <laughs> oh, I don't want to know. Oops, sorry. That must have hurt. Stop. Earth to Jala. This is not the time to get distracted. Her thighs. They're just so powerful. 
Whoa, you're in love. Snap out of it. Your ill-timed thirst is gonna get our asses kicked. Close your eyes. Why are you so interested in her thighs? You know, that throne doesn't really look all that comfortable. That's because she brings the padding with her. Aruni! What? I'm supposed to pretend not to notice her ass? I'm imaginary, not dead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we need help with this whole situation. Remember how we summoned Mom before? Would that help? Mom? Seriously? No! Think, Jala! Who do we know who's an expert in messy lesbian psychosexual drama? Oh! <gasps> Don't tell me Auntie Cassandra is a lesbian. Oh my god. You're right. Auntie Chandra! Oh, Auntie Chandra! Summon Auntie Chandra! If she can't help you out of this one, you're doomed! Do it, do it, do it! <gasps> Auntie Chandra! Auntie! What the heck? Yo, lift! Yeah! Whoa! Wow, oh my god. Shoot, it's all dangerous. It's pretty cool. Auntie Chandra is the best. Thank you, Auntie. You were too invested in her thighs. Where are your eyeballs, girl? I thought what I wanted was revenge, but the truth is, I'm still not over you, Jala. Oh my god! I knew it, I knew it. She was still into Jala. I ship it, Loki. Be honest. You're not over me either. Ooh, you're not over her. Are you kidding me? When Irfan told me you kissed him in junior year, I knew. When Irfan told me you kissed him, you. You cheated on Tyler. You were obviously bored of her, but it wasn't about Irfan, was it? It was a message to me. And that's why I told everyone what you and Erfan were doing behind Tyler's back. Oh my god, you're messy. You kissed you kissed a boy while you're dating Tyler? You're messy. <clears throat> that's messy. Okay. I was the one who messed up, so I have no grounds to complain. But Irfan? He was ostracized. Everyone blamed him. I just told the truth. You were the one in the wrong. She right, you were in the wrong. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice. She right, you were in the wrong, Jella. I went out with Irfan after my thing with you blew up. Of all the boys in school, you picked my ex? Come on. He was your beard. Oh, <laughs> shoot. Oh, that was your fake boyfriend. I got you. I went out with Ifran after my thing when you blew up. Oh, so after me, I mean after Jala, you broke up. After Jala, you went after that guy? But he was your, oh yeah, yeah, he was your beard for sure. For those who don't know, beard is a person who, you're not really dating, but you try to act straight, so they're your beard. To look at your street, you're not. <laughs> you don't even like boys. I was figuring things out. He was nice about it, actually. Oh. As boyfriends go, I could have done a lot worse. You can lie to yourself all you want. But what we had, what we did to each other, none of it was good or bad. What did you guys do to each other? Why did she make it sound like it's so bad? <clears throat> it was transformational. Wow, you really, you really helped her with her lesbianness. I'm not sorry. And I don't want your apologies. You know what? You shouldn't be sorry. It's Jala's fault. She should be sorry. But you should feel bad for, for bullying Tyler. But I understand. But you should feel bad though. You should at least say sorry for that. You should feel bad for that at least. All I want is a chance to transform you in return. What? I knew she was into us. Why we heal? <laughs> Why do we heal after that? <laughs> Sorry. I don't want to hurt you, Jala. 
Oh, all right. I do want to hurt you. A little. Say this. Come on, girl. You can't resist me. I'm too pretty. Are you always this self assured? <clears throat> no, but I know exactly what I want now. Hmm. Be honest with yourself. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Almost as much as you are. <laughs> You're funny. Why are lesbians? Why are lesbians so? Chaotic. What should we do? Let's taunt. I mean, it's right here. Stop. Stop hurting me. Oh, it's been too long since we've had an execution. Wow. Bloodthirsty little thing, aren't you? <laughs> They're what I made them. I'm the one in charge here, after all. Oh, we use a new one now. Let's do party darts. Hit entire group. Oh, there's only one person. Oh, sorry, but I want to try it. How do you like my new sound? What sound? like you still have feelings for me. Ah, hilarious. <laughs> You're not over you her. Grateful our queen cares enough to destroy you personally. Wow. I think gratitude's a bit much to ask. Yeah, it is. Silence, traitor! Come on. You know I'm so cool, girl. Admit it, dear. All your confidence is just a front. You actually crave my approval. I can see that too. She said no. Nope. Your every move is a poem, Maharani. What do you call Maharani? What does that mean? Does it mean something? I feel like it do. Going down, dear. Only if you ask very, very nicely. Oh my gosh, she for you. <laughs> you she knew what I meant. Stop. Your chord progressions make angels weep, Maharani. Seriously, you're into all this boot licking? Oh, I'm into all sorts of things these days, Jala. Oh. oh. Girl, you know I'm pretty. I can think of a few other ways we could resolve all this tension. Yes, we get it. This fight is metaphorical. Don't remind me. <laughs> oh, she rejected us. Damn. She's strong. What is she doing? She got four us? Hot out, Jala. The least you can do is enjoy it. Is she got four of us? She's not into it. Are you paying attention yet, Jala? Or do I need to step up my game? I am both paying attention and also very, very distracted right now. <laughs> there he is, lesbians. Come on, girl. Right in the stomach. Up. Be honest with yourself. You're enjoying this, aren't you? There's no more. As I recall, you never cared that much about my pleasure, pillow princess. Oh, you did all the work. Whoops. But for those of you who don't know, pillow princess means she just laid down while Jar does everything. <laughs> if that makes sense to you. <clears throat> Wasn't 
wasn't as perfect as you think it was, you know. You were accepted by your family, athletic, popular, smart, and in love. Did I miss anything? Okay, she's got you there. Whoops. Make up? I oh, thought that said make out. Come on, let's be friends. Rock and roll, bye, Good bye. Words. Not just rationalizations and justifications. Words lie. The truth is in the music. Music. Let's play. We still sound good together. Don't you dare forget it. I want to hear. I want to see them play together. Yes. I think one game I play. I thought it would make me happy to see you heartbroken, questioning yourself. I don't know. I kind of like her. I kind of want to see Jala with her. But then I also want to see Jada with Tyler because Tyler's obviously, well, she's in the freaking game front picture. So like, it's kind of obvious she's the, like the canon ending. But you know what? I think I'll make two gameplays where at, like, when we're at the ending, I can pick her as the other option for those who want to see it. And you know what? It kind of still does. I'm over getting revenge. I'm over apologies. I'm actually over you. You're over me? I thought you were not over her. What the heck? We can still be friends, Dia. It's not too late. <clears throat> Maybe. I've let you be the protagonist of my story for way too long. You're not even the villain as much as I wanted you to be. And that's as far as I can go right now. Is that enough? If anything, you're... You're mad because everything went wrong. She got everything she wanted, and your parents didn't accept you. You're jealous of us, too. <laughs> I can work with that. <clears throat> Thanks, Maharani. Ooh, Ma Ma Maharani. What does that mean? Look at me. I'm fast, boy. Look at me. Oh, I punched you in the face. Look at me. Oh my God, it's another bear. I hate them. Bully them. Oh, I, I bully myself. Where's the shop? I want to buy something real quick. If we can, at least. Boy. What is that? Enter store. What's in here? What up, Jake? Welcome to Loops. It's where people come, take what they want, and then leave your life forever, never once looking back. Um, okay. Have you been sleeping okay? This is a boyfriend. When I close my eyes, I see Theo. Ooh, can we, hit the, can we get them back together? Aww. So I've been drinking coffee for the past 24 hours straight. Oh, he's not there. Oh. Hmm. Only the bitterness of the bean matches that of life's cruel embrace. Go back out with him. Mm-hmm. Sure. Thrilled for you and your newfound life's purpose. He needs help. Help him. God, were we ever that young? Yes. <laughs> Ooh, rainbow sneakers. Buy it. Do we got money? We do. Oh, we're getting, we're getting it out. This is a gay game. Must, might, might as well just get it out, right? Hell yeah, girl. What, we got one for her too? Boost defense, increase defense. Okay, let's do that. Wait, what is her channel? Her charm? I wanna see it again. No way, no, 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 here. Oh, it's just like their head. Oh, we can just use both. I don't have that many, so I'll just use you both. But when I have another one is better, I'll throw one of you out. <laughs> Probably Sergio, because I don't like him that much. I mean, he's sweet. But I'm just not... No. I like her more. Sorry. Let's go, boy. Okay, time to leave. What's over there? Is this a bar? Yeah. Come on, go home. 
Get out of the way. Move. Get out the way. No. No diner. He said all he could see is steel. Well, guess what, boy? I am steel. Uh-oh. Look, I can't believe I'm saying this. Sergio was right. What's she right about? Ah! Jonas changed. We talked it out. We even played the guitar. Is that a metaphor? Why? Are you jealous? <laughs> yes. No? Why would I be jealous? John and I are just good friends. I'm very glad to hear that from you, Sergio. Then you won't mind that I made beautiful music with her. <laughs> oh. Ugh, you're both pathetic. Tyler, you know you want me, you know you want Jella. Don't pretend, girl. Oh, you think you're immune? Wait till you see her in person. She we did. I have already. What? She's helping me with my investigation into Barefoot Park. Why are y'all meeting up my exes? You're creepy. <laughs> See, I haven't lost my mind, unlike you two. I told you, I'm over her. So what you're saying is, you two have regular plans to meet up. Just the two of you. Sus. They're not dates. It's for the investigation. Mm, they sound a lot like dates, babe. <sighs> Call me babe again, Tarzan, I dare you. If we're going in chronological order, it's it fun next. Oh. Um, excuse me? <laughs> I think you have your timelines confused. No way! I made a diagram! Why do I want to take turns? Am I that special? Am I that special? You said to count you out. Uh, maybe we could skip me just for now? Why? No way. We all agreed. Apart from me. Apart from Tyler, who's still in denial about her participation, we're in this together all the way to the end am i that important for you guys to be doing this at night i guess i am they're all into me don't lie i'm not i'm too beautiful for all you look at jala she's so cool she's a queen bee what we got fill off your scooter down on my face and there's blood everywhere fifth the whole neighborhood holds you crying you ran to my rescue cleaning me up and took care of me until i got home I had my moments. Moment that treated us uh, to ice cream at Yaya's that day. Huh. Papa, I have something to tell you. I have many things to tell you. Hmm, I can see you're not in the mood for talking. Maybe a nice documentary about the Cold War. Ugh, Dad. Fine. But next time, I pick. This is so. This always makes me happy here. That is so sweet. I wish my dad was like that. My dad is not like that. 